The new Samsung Galaxy S23, S23 Plus, and Galaxy S23 Ultra Leaker measures show a few design differences to the Galaxy S22, and indicate a surprise at the launch despite the fact that there have been many leaks about the Galaxy S23 line, there should be a feature for the Galaxy Unpacked event that nobody has revealed so far. The Isis LHP2 has a 200 megapixel sensor and a slew of enhancements that make it an exceptional photography phone. We have a 1.3-inch sensor with tetra-squared pixel binning technology, which allows the sensor to shoot at 12.5 megapixels, 50 megapixels, and 200 megapixels. It also uses pixel binning at around 33 megapixels to shoot 8K videos at 30 frames per second without cropping, and thanks to new pixel technology, we get much better control of the exposure rates, as well as better autofocus even in low light conditions and reduced shutter lag for high-resolution images. To put it simply, the Galaxy S23 Ultra is expected to deliver excellent camera performance. Samsung is also introducing a new technology known as DVDG, which is a dual vertical transmission aid that increases pixel capacity by 33%. This new ISO Cell HP2 sensor provides significantly improved color reproduction and exposure control. So bright photographs will no longer be overexposed on the S23 Ultra with a new 200 megapixel camera and if you ever encounter the watch-out images, you no longer need to fear. The Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra can also burst at 15 frames per second, shooting 15 photos in a single second at a resolution of 200 megapixels. We also have a brand new Super QPD autofocus tech that will make this phone exceptionally snappy in autofocus and video, particularly in low light. Along with this, Samsung has launched dual-slope HDR for the first time, which will manage HDR performance much as a standard 12 megapixel mode even while shooting at high 50 megapixels. As we've observed with previous Samsung phones, when we shoot in greater megapixel settings, the camera performs better. The HDR performance is always compromised, however this will no longer be the case owing to dual-slope HDR. At 50 megapixel resolution, you should be able to obtain excellent clarity while having outstanding HDR performance, moreover you will receive a $50 credit if you pre-order the gadget right now, but you will surely get a $100 credit if you pre-order both the laptop and the smartphone. So without been said let me know your thought in the comment below and if you are new here please subscribe peace out.